opening with the queen's pawn controls the center and usually leads to a more positional development of the pieces. The Indian game begins by controlling the important e4 square with the knight, rather than a pawn. c4 builds a strong center by controlling the important d5 square and creates a square for the knight to come to c3 without blocking the c-pawn. The Benoni defense immediately attacks the d4 pawn and creates squares for the black queen to develop. d5 grabs more space in the center and prevents black from trading the c-pawn for the white center pawn. d6 supports the c5 pawn and allows the light squared bishop to develop. And c3 develops the knight toward the center, supports the d5 pawn and controls the e4 square. g6 prepares to fianchetto the dark squared bishop to g7, where it will sit on the long diagonal. e4 takes space in the center, supports the d5 pawn and allows the light squared bishop to develop. This fianchettos the bishop by placing it on a powerful diagonal. This activates a bishop by developing it off of its starting square. Castling gets the king to a safer square, out of the center of the board, while also developing a rook. Castling king side tends to be safer because the king is further from the center. This develops a knight off its starting square, getting it into the action. e6 challenges white's d-pawn and controls f5. Castling gets the king out of the center and activates the rook. After all captures, this is an equal trade. Recaptures. It is the last book move. This misses an opportunity to develop a knight off its starting square. This allows the opponent to kick a knight. It is an inaccuracy. This kicks an opposing knight. It is best. This allows the knight to control more squares. It is best. Right on target. It is best. The game was close to balanced, but now black is worse. It is an inaccuracy. The opposing knight is kicked by a pawn, and must now move or be captured. It is excellent. This moves the knight to safety. It is excellent. This develops a piece while also winning a tempo on a knight. It is good. This defends the attacked knight. This threatens to win material. It is best. This threatens to win a queen. There was only one good move there. This overlooks an opportunity to threaten winning a pawn. It is a mistake. This leads to losing a pawn. This threatens to create a passed pawn. It is an inaccuracy. That was a truly amazing move. It is brilliant. This ignores an opportunity to recapture a piece. It is a mistake. Recaptures. It is best. This maintains the balance in material with a good trade. It is excellent. This is an equal trade. It is best. This overlooks an opportunity to capture a knight that was threatening to win material. It is an inaccuracy. This moves the queen to safety. This threatens to play checkmate. It is excellent. That was a free bishop. It is best. That was a great move and very hard to find. This is the only move that works. This threatens to win a rook. It is brilliant. This misses an opportunity to win material. This permits the opponent to develop a piece while also winning a tempo on a bishop. It is a miss. This is the way to win a pawn. It is excellent. This maintains the balance in material with a good trade. It is best. Recaptures. This threatens to force eventual checkmate. It is best. This attacks a bishop, winning a tempo when it moves away. It is good. That was a truly amazing move. It is brilliant. That's a sensible reply. It is excellent takes back. It is best. This wins time by threatening a queen and forcing it to move away. It is best. This wins a queen. It is best. This blocks the check from an opposing queen. It is best. This overlooks a better way to move a queen to safety. This allows the opponent to develop a piece while also winning a tempo on a queen. It is an inaccuracy. This activates a piece and simultaneously wins time by attacking an opposing queen. It is best. This threatens to win a knight. It is best. 
This defends a knight that was under attack and had no defenders. It is best. This wins material. It is excellent. This protects the attack rook. It is best. A very strong play. It is excellent. This misses a better way to defend a knight that was under attack. It is an inaccuracy. This attacks a queen, winning a tempo when it moves away. It is good. This move puts the queen on a safer square. It is good. This exposes an attack, threatening a rook. This threatens to win material. It is excellent. This offers to exchange pieces of equal value. It is good. This wins material. It is good. This overlooks an opportunity to centralize a knight so it controls more squares. It is an inaccuracy. This captures a vulnerable rook. It is good. Recaptures. It is best. This takes an open file, a common method for activating a rook. It is best. This allows the knight to control more squares. It is best. That's what I would have recommended. It is best. This defends a pawn that was under attack and had no defenders. It is good. This moves the queen to safety. It is best. This blocks the check from an opposing queen. It is excellent. This threatens to win a pawn. It is best. This steps away from the checking rook. It is best. This is the strongest option. It is best. One of the best moves. It is excellent. This wins a knight. This threatens to force eventual checkmate. It is best. This frees a pinned queen, allowing it to provide defense. It is good. Sudden a close game that was lost by a mistake. White really outplayed black in that one. Black had a good opening, but white was on another level. White was a cut above black in the middle game. 